Bradley, um, could you tell us uh, your full name, age, your sponsors, and what you're doing here? Okay, so uh, I'm Bradley William Smith, I'm 21 years old, I'm <coughs> the Tech 3 Motor 2 team, um, and we're here racing the Indianapolis for the, the Motor DP. Is this the first time you've been here or have you been, been here before? Uh, so I've been coming to Indy now since 2008, so oh. uh, yeah, it's been a few years now. Yeah, so you know your way around. Yeah, I know my way around and uh, really enjoy coming to America. It's the only time we get to do it in the season. So obviously we get to the season, but we only get to see the there. So Indy's the only chance that we really get to, to ride here in America and uh, I love it. Great. Uh, how, how have you found the track today? A lot of people seem to be good doing high five. Yeah, it's one of those things because the, the infield doesn't get used uh, a lot during the season. It gets really green. Um, the track continues to evolve, you know, and get grippier and grippier, but there's something to do with uh, once the heat comes up, then the grip almost goes back down again later on in the day. And, uh, it's easy to get caught out here. There's a couple of corners where you know you're really doing a long, long, long maximum lead, and I think that's what we saw today. But um, you have to be careful here. It's yeah. a little bit less grip than we get normally, um, which makes it a challenge for my set. And uh, how do you feel for uh, for the race tomorrow? Um, it's going to be tough. Um, we're starting from 14th on the grid, so uh, I'm going to have to really you know, focus on the start and the first couple of corners. Um, we need to improve some things in warm-up. We have some ideas that we want to try in warm-up, so we'll see if we get anywhere there. Um, and then we'll wait and see. Like I said, here gets quite quite slippery, so uh, the tyres drop off quite quick. So it will be all about tyre management and uh, you know being able to use throttle control and pick up the bike as much as possible. It'll be uh, a little bit like dirt tracking out there. So uh, I'm quite excited. Of course, I'm not not over the moon with the, the result today, but um, I think we can sit down, come up with a plan, and uh, improve it. Uh, uh, basically, soft on the front and uh, kind of a medium on the rear. Uh, Dunlop, Dunlop tires. So Dunlop is uh, supplying all of Mutter 2. So uh, all the riders are on the same tires and we have a choice of two fronts and two rears. So uh, everyone's pretty much on the same. Yeah, I've raced 20 years on Dunlop. <laughs> Okay, uh, we have uh, quite a few readers who are racers themselves and they're in their tweens and their teens. Uh, what recommendations can you give to them to get to this level? Um, you know, it's a, it's a tough one. Uh, it's a lot of hard work. Uh, you have to be in the right place at the right time, uh, but you have to always you know, showcase your, your talent as, as best as you can. Uh, you know, you have to, to work on all the small things. You know, just riding fast sometimes isn't isn't good enough. Um, it's the, the small details. Um, you know, understanding bike settings, and understanding uh, data. Um, you know, training hard away from the track. You know, working on your diet and your preparation and things like that. Um, because you know, everyone can. A lot of riders can ride fast, but you have to have something that sets you apart and makes that extra little bit of a difference. And, uh, yeah, that's, that's all I can do. You know, if you're doing things that other people aren't, it's not really a good thing. Uh, are you into the uh, latest thing is cycling at home? Yeah, cycling and uh, triathlon is kind of my, my main training. Um, you know, with road racing, it's quite a versatile sport. There's not actually a set training program, so uh, you know you need to need to be honest with yourself. And can I go 100 percent from the start of the race to the end? If the answer is no, then you need to get yourself in the gym. Um, you know, and work on cardio, work on strength, and kind of be a jack of jack of all, master of none. You know, that seems to be the the best way forward. And where do you go from here? Um, so basically we get on a plane tomorrow night and um, go back to Czech Republic um, where we race in Bruno next weekend so it's going to be a busy schedule um, and then we have two weeks off uh, and then we'll be in, uh, in Italy so uh, you know, after the summer break it gets quite busy again um, so yeah plenty of riding, plenty of track time and plenty of fun.
and what's your target for the year? Well, at the moment we're seventh in the championship. We need to continue, you know, that. I think realistically we can push towards, you know, that fifth, sixth position. Um, but we'll see, you know. Uh, race day is always my my forte. I need to be able to pull myself forward on race day. Qualifying is always a little bit of a struggle for me. So uh, hopefully tomorrow, as the race goes on, I can pull myself forward and uh, not lose too much points to my title. Well, it's been a really nice talking to you, and uh, our readers will see you on YouTube. Uh, you're welcome, thank you.